Welcome to American Patriot News. So today uh, we're going to talk about the, the governor of New York, Kathy Hochul, and the district attorney, Alvin Bragg, and the mayor, Eric Adams, and uh, what happened with Officer Diller, who was murdered by a career criminal. But guys, before I get into that, if you would, please like, share, and if you're new, subscribe. Those things really impact the algorithm and help me out tremendously. All right. So basically what happened is at different times, the DA and the mayor, it sounds like, were there around the same time. But Kathy Hochul came on her own. I'm going to read you a little something. So check this out. This is uh, Brian Kilmeade. That's where the information comes from, from Fox. Kathy Hochul getting an earful as she was leaving the wake for murdered NYPD officer Jonathan Diller in Massapequa. A source tells me this happened moments after Hochul uh, refused to abide by the family's wishes. They were doing an open casket and viewing, and so she came in while they were closing the casket, and she just stormed in. They couldn't stop her. I'm told that family members let her have it when she got there, saying, his blood is on your hands. Hochul wasn't the only one approached at the wake. Mayor Eric Adams and District Attorney Alvin Bragg were both confronted directly, this time by Diller's wife. The source tells me she let them have it too, telling them the same thing she told the governor, his blood is on your hands. And that is absolutely a fact. This guy has been arrested 21 times, nine felonies, career criminal. I love that Officer Hochul's wife let them have it. They deserve it. Because you know what? In the last analysis, it's their fault. Guys, we're live Monday morning at 930. Have a wonderful rest of your day.